first like real album. Bot? I have no idea. And buy it. First real album. I don't know that. Like Columbia House or something like that. I got a stack like <sighs> Public Enemy, In Excess, U2. Yeah, I had a Rush album. Grace Under Pressure. They were all tapes and they were all crap. I had a. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like any of them. Did you take them back? No, because it was through the mail. But it was U2 was one of those bands that you just you, you should like. Yeah. They're huge. Yeah. But I never. Not just because they're huge. I mean, I never got into it at the time. Yeah. What else was there? Public Enemy. I was looking for uh, Wild Wild West by uh, Cool Moody, cool but. I thought it was public enemy. I had, you had to go to the Royal Ring for that one. That was awesome. What else was there? In Excess Kick. Which is just a good album. It's pretty good when you go back. Sean, what's the first album you ever bought? Uh, the first, it was a 45. Okay, I love yeah. rock and roll, Joan Jett. The first album would be uh, <laughs> Styx, uh, Kill Roy Was Here. First full album I ever bought. But you bought that I bought. Like I always got them for gifts. Yeah, like I remember getting like I remember my birthday when Thriller came out. I got eight copies of Thriller. Everybody just went, ah, oh, he like yeah. this. Really. Mm-hmm. Just and I don't think I knew enough music to take them back in exchange. So I just <laughs> never had gave one to my sister. Gave really? one to my mom. You never had that album? I always had to have it put on for me. I wasn't allowed to touch the stereo. The record so like just waiting all primed in front of the you stereo. You can see wait. it's all the old records that I used to listen to when I was a kid in our record collection, like. Kenny Rogers, like Gambler, and like American Pie and stuff. The middle parts just all scratched, and like there's so <laughs> many scratches. You know what I mean? Yeah, I wrecked a couple of good ones. When I first got into Led Zeppelin, and the uh, the stereo was in the dining room. I just remember putting on Black Dog on, on vinyl, and I was and I thought it was broken. Like you know where the, the time goes weird. I'm like listening at the thing and the, <laughs> the record was like a little bit wobbly. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, this is messed up, man. So I took it off, I put it on again, and I was like, I was like, Dad, this this record <laughs> like melted or something. I don't know. <laughs> totally remember that, like sort of being scared, like, oh god, like some like the drums kept going, but the guitar was like stuck on the needle. <laughs> <laughs>